everyone. I'm back, Miss Thrasher, ready to go for another day. Um, today's topic is about in intentional and unintentional injuries. This is a lesson that um, may be a bit startling, maybe a little um, sad and a little somber, uh, just because intentional injury is something that we have um, experienced an increase in. Um, over the past 10, 12 years, it is something that is very sad and it might um, have happened to someone in your family, it might have happened to someone very close to you. And so this is one of those topics that is not fun to talk about, but we also have to. Um, so I will be giving you a bunch of resources to look through um, while you're working through this, as well as um, talking to you a little bit about it on here. So unintentional injuries are those um, times when we don't realize that we're about to get hurt in a situation. So things like um, car accidents where you don't expect someone to fly out next to you um, and hit the side of your car. Um, a lot of motor vehicle accidents are um, big unintentional injuries. But I mean, there's other times where maybe you're um, helping your mom or dad cook in the kitchen and you um, are cutting up the carrots for something and it accidentally slices your finger. Um, these are very unintentional injuries and these are things that are accidents, basically, is what they're called. Um, and so making sure that we know the difference between these two um, is very important. Um, intentional injury is when you are um, harming yourself on purpose, harming yourself or someone else on purpose. Um, so this is um, as sad and as somber as um, homicides and suicides, uh, which are never fun to talk about, but um, very important to know uh, the difference between these two so that you can help um, prevent these kind of in injuries. Um, so we've talked about, obviously in the home, we've talked about um, ways to um, prevent these injuries for having things like plans set in place or um, first aid kits set in place. Intentional injuries are something that are more um, on the psychological side. We are we are thinking about how we're thinking about things and how we're thinking about um, possibly harming ourselves or others. So these are the times when we need to really look into our resource lists that are important and that are valid and reliable to us um, to make sure we're getting all of the right information. So I will be sending you lots of resources to look through um, as well as a worksheet to look through um, to make sure that you're getting all of the right and correct information um, throughout this lesson. It is not the funnest. I get that. I know it's not fun at all, but we're also getting um, to the age where we do need to talk about um, the importance of knowing the difference and knowing what you can do to help prevent injury within your household, within your workplace, or even in school. So uh, with that, I will be sending you lots of information on this um, as well as um, a place for you to message if you are feeling uncomfortable about this situation, um, about this lesson. It's not fun to talk about it. It's not great to talk about it. Um, but it's very important for information for you to know, especially in this unit. Um, and knowing who to contact and how you can um, help in these situations. So, with that, I want you all to have a day. And it's your job to make it a great one. Thank you.